video blog. I'm Dr. Bruce Leslie Chance for the Alamo Colleges, and I'm standing at the AMT lab at the Workforce Center for Excellence. This is an amazing program that provides multi-skilled education for individuals who are going to be working for major corporations like Toyota and HEB in the robotics field. And we've had great success. We're expanding this program dramatically. But what I really want to talk about is Alamo Confidence. This, to me, is the capstone program to pull together so many of the initiatives that we've developed over the years that have had such positive effect, such as Alamo Advise, now Alamo Institutes, Ready the First Day of Class, Welcome Home, all these efforts to make students feel more comfortable coming to the Alamo Colleges, more prepared for their studies here, and now what we're working on is getting better information for students earlier, particularly while they're in high school or for adult learners, while they're still thinking about uh, coming back to college for a new career, making sure that they know what is their career objective, what is the right institute for them to be entering, what is the right program of studies, and for those students who want to go on or need to go on for a baccalaureate in their field, what is the university that they want to pursue, which is one of the reasons why we are back mapping all of the primary degree programs that our partner universities, both here and in Austin. We now have 16 universities in our transfer network. We'll be adding several others over the next uh, several months. We've back mapped over 200 programs already. The point is that today with uh, HB5, students going into high school, going into ninth grade, are supposed to select an endorsement, which means a program of study, a direction, and then when they come to us or to a university to pursue either that same or make a, a change so that they are pursuing the right pathway for their ultimate success. And we know that students who know what they want to study, know what they want to pursue, are more likely to graduate than students who don't. So the whole idea here is we need to get better information to students. The problem we have is, it's not just here in San Antonio, but nationally, we do a very poor job of providing information to students about what are their opportunities for different kinds of degrees, different kinds of careers, uh, what are the demanded careers in their particular region? Where can they get high wage, high demand jobs? Uh, why should they go into aerospace or robotics or IT or IT security when they don't even know anything about those programs? So one of the parts to this Alamo confidence idea is number one, students by having greater confidence will be more likely to succeed and graduate with their associate's degree and or their baccalaureate degree. Secondarily, that employers will be uh, confident that the students that they are hiring have the requisite skills, both the technical skills, the skills in the particular field, and the so-called soft skills, what we call the leadership skills. And that's a increasingly uh, in greater demand by employers today is that students really understand the work environment and the skills necessary to help the company be, to be successful. So the problem is, if we don't provide adequate information to students, particularly while they're preparing to go into the endorsement and then on to college, they're not going to pick the programs that may be of best value to them and best value to our employers and to our community. So a key part of Alamo Confidence is working with the employer community for them to own providing better information to our community so students can make really the right choices for their future. We can't tell a student what to pursue. We can only give them information so that they make the best decision for themselves. So Alamo Confidence is about student confidence, knowing what I want to pursue as early as possible. We want students to know that before they even enroll for the first time in the Alamo Colleges. For employers to have confidence the students that they employ, whether they come directly from us or from a baccalaureate program, are going to have the confidence in the student's ability. That our ISD partners have confidence sending their students to the Alamo Colleges because they know they're going to have an outstanding education and will be able to go into the career of their choice. That the universities have confidence that our students are university prepared. We expect ISDs to ensure their students are college ready we need to make sure that our students are university ready so that they succeed when they go on for a baccalaureate. We have 300,000 people in Bear County alone that have some college but no degree. We need to help every student complete their journey and then we want the community to have confidence that the work we're doing meets the community's needs so down the line when we 
present another bond election or tax increase are going to support that for all the right reasons. So that's the heart of Alamo confidence. We'll talk more about it in the future, particularly next time I want to talk more about the Alamo Institutes. Thanks for joining the Chancellor's Video Blog. Look forward to talking to you next week.